one of the most common questions I'm getting almost, seems like almost every single day is, Brandon, which lead provider is better, Vulcan 7 or the Red X? And so in today's video, I wanted to kind of break down the difference between both, and then I'll give you my honest assessment as to which lead provider I think makes more sense for your business. The truth is I was with Red X for a long time. I mean, really up into, I would say, uh, the beginning of 2020, I was a Red X user. There's videos of me talking about how much I like Red X. And, you know, Red X has done a lot for my business. And I'm now on the Vulcan 7 platform. And I want to and I want to share with you the differences so that Again, you can make the decision. You can decide what's best for your business, but now I'm speaking from personal experience with both of these lead providers. Now, as we start off this debate, you know, the most important advice I could give you, the real estate agent, if you're watching this, if you're brand new, you're thinking about getting into, uh, into the industry, you have never prospected before, you've got tons of experience, it doesn't matter where you're at in your business, the reality, and, and I stand firm on this, is I believe you have to have a lead provider getting you these three lead sources are an absolute must as a real estate agent. What are they? That is the new and old expired listings for sale by owners and for rent by owners or furbos you'll hear me refer to. Those three lead sources are the lowest hanging fruit in the entire real estate industry, and those have to be in your prospecting business plan, hands down. Now, you can add more lead sources on later. You can add other lead sources and different things, but uh, those are the three lead sources I think every real estate agent should have, regardless of what their business plan uh, will have in addition to those, okay? So, with that being said, you absolutely have to have a lead provider getting you those lead sources on a consistent basis. So you're not spending your time searching for all these different leads uh, out there with all the different sources. That's number one. Number two, let's talk about price. So if you go and price these, these two uh, competitors out, they're about the same price now, especially if you use our discount link for Vulcan 7, which I'll have a link to that in the description beneath this video. If you use that link, you're gonna, you're gonna find that the pricing between Vulcan 7 and the Red X, about the same. It's right around $280 per month. So from that standpoint, it's very, very competitive. Now, let's look at the features and the benefits of each platform. This is where I think there's a massive, massive difference. When we talk about the prospecting database or the prospecting CRM, for years, when I was on the Red X platform, again, there's probably videos of me on the YouTube platform talking about my folder system. For literally, probably, a, probably I would say five, six, seven years of my real estate career, I was using literally a paper lead follow-up system. What do I mean by that? I would generate a lead, I talked to a for sale by owner, I would talk to an expired listing, and I would write their information on a piece of paper and put it into a filing system that I mastered. It, it, it did me well, it served the purpose, and I used that system for a long time. Matter of fact, I trained my, my students in my coaching program on that exact system. It worked great. However, the reason I did that is the Red X technology, their uh, lead management system, their prospecting CRM, whatever you wanna call it, is built in a way for me and i'm not a tech i'm not a crazy tech guy so uh, for me the tech was a bit overwhelming it was hard to use i was losing leads they would fall through the cracks it was hard to you know organize my folders with inside their database and so i said the heck with it I'm, I'm i'm costing myself too much money messing around with technology on the computer thus i created my folder system now I've been on Vulcan 7 now since the beginning of 2020, and I will tell you, the simplicity of the technology is absolute genius. I've gotten rid of my old um, outdated, I guess maybe you could argue, paper system, but there's a lot of value in having that paper system that served me for so many years because that old age saying, out of sight, out of mind, is so true with lead follow-up. Most of your biggest problem is um, 
losing opportunities. You generate a lead today, you have no system for following up. They fall through the cracks. You got sticky notes everywhere. So um, now that I'm on Vulcan 7, their technology, their prospecting CRM database is built in such a way where they have this folder system. It's almost like, uh, and I didn't build the system, I won't take credit for it, but it's almost like they took my folder system my my actual physical folders and put it in a piece of technology it is that simple and now it is it is so easy to organize leads when i generate a lead to organize my leads inside of a piece of technology where i'm not losing leads they're not falling through the cracks and i'm not losing out on these opportunities and i don't have to get lost in the technology uh it's a very very easy simple piece of technology to use, okay? So from that standpoint, I really like uh, that a lot. Um, now, the most important part, we talk about, you know, the, the the championship round, if you will. If these guys were going face-to-face, -face, which they do, I'm sure, on a daily basis, you have to talk about data quality or the quality of the leads. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're watching this now or sometime in the future, the quality of leads that Vulcan 7 gives you is hands down, not even close, so much better than the data that you get from Red X. Now, it's unfortunate that that's the reality, but it is the truth. I was, I've been on both platforms now, and the challenge with the Red X platform, even if you get their Onyx data, which is, you know, uh, uh, supposedly their, their their top end data that you can purchase, which is even more expensive. If you go and you're going after expired listings with the Red X prospecting platform. They're giving you seven, you know, 17 leads for every one expired. Vulcan 7, I don't know how they do it, okay? I'm not a data person. I don't know how to do what they do. Uh, the contact ratio, if you call expireds for two hours, it is extremely difficult to debate that you're gonna have uh, more contacts using Vulcan 7 than you would the Red X system. Matter of fact, I would almost guarantee you that if you spent two hours calling expireds with the Vulcan 7 data and two hours calling expired uh, listings from, from the Red X system, you will probably almost double the amount of people uh, that you will talk to, not only talk to, but the right homeowner, the right decision maker. If you're on Red X now, you know exactly what I'm talking about. You, when you uh, get an expired listing lead, there's like, 12 phone numbers and it probably takes you a good 10 minutes maybe eight minutes to get through all of those they're ringing you got voicemails you got wrong numbers and i'll just tell you even if vulcan 7 ends up being a little bit more expensive than the red x system you know we're in business to to help our, our clients to go out there and get listings even if it was a few dollars more which i'm not sure that it is but even if it was i would make the argument and, and, and highly recommend that you still use the Vulcan 7 system. That's where I'm at. You know, and I am curious to see kind of what your guys' thoughts are in the comment section beneath this video. What is your experience? There's a bunch of other providers out there. What is your favorite provider when it comes to for sell by owner data, for rent by owner, and expired listing data specifically? Do you like one of these companies? Do you like a different company? Let me know in the comment section. And like I said, I've been on both platforms and I'll tell you that the Vulcan 7 system from every standpoint, price, ease of use, and the lead quality is far superior than that of their biggest competition, the Red X. And don't take my word for it, try it out. I put a link in the, in the description. You can get a discount for both of these companies, matter of fact, um, try them out. You be the judge. Go call some expired listings on both platforms and then you tell me which platform you thought was better. But I had to make this video because I get so many questions about these two companies. That's my stance. That's my position. I hope that it's provided you some clarity, some value. If it has, please subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you never miss anything on my channel. And I'll plan on seeing you guys in another video very soon. Thank you guys so much for your continued support and watching today's video. We'll talk to you guys soon.